Hello everybody and welcome to another one of my videos. Today I'm going to be doing for you tamarind punch. I'm going to be doing this my style. It's a recipe what I've just tried for the first time. So I hope you all enjoy this one. We're going to show you the ingredients what we're going to be using for today. So our ingredients what we're going to be using today, we're going to be using condensed milk. Going to be using some rum, some nourishment, some dragon stout, milk, and nutmeg. And these are the tamarind what we're going to be using for today. I've already um, put them in water. As you can see, and it's nice and pulpy. And this was donated by one of my subscribers. Thank you for, for that. So, tamarind is something that is a bit bitterish. Well, bitterish or sweets. We usually um, they usually make sweets with sugar with this and roll them into balls but I thought um, when I was given this I thought what can I do with it so I try going to try it with um, making it into a punch right so we've got our jug and we're going to get some of this pulp out With the tamarind, I think they use it in a lot of cooking recipes. You can do um, biscuits with it. But like I was saying before, like over in Jamaica, we mostly use, use it and make the um, sweet balls with it. So it's just the pulp what, what you want. And I hope everybody's liking our videos what we're putting out please remember when you go over to like share and subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend and if you want to leave a comment please leave a comment in the comment section we do get back to you on them but always remember there's going to be a time when we can't answer all of them but we will answer as many as we can. So I'm going to use that amount for now. So that's the amount what I've got out of it. So we're going to need a, a whisk to that. And we're going to put in our milk. I'm just going to whisk that, whisk that through to get that incorporated. Yeah. 
And we're going to put in some of our sweet milk. As the tamarind is is got a bit of sweetness to it already, you know, just sweeten it to how you want it. Gonna put in about half a cap full of rum because we don't want it to overpower it. That's so about half a cap full. Then we're gonna grate her in our nutmeg. other ingredients what I forgot to mention what I was going to put in we're going to put in some almond this is almond essence just going to put in about half a capful I'm going to put in And about the same amount of, of vanilla. Might just put in a capful. I'm just going to whisk that through. going to put in some nourishment and we're going to put in our dragon stout just going to whisk that through Right, so we've got our, all our ingredients incorporated. So I'm going to taste it. That's really nice. Nice, got a nice fruit, fruitiness to it. You don't taste the bitterness of the tamarind at all. So if you make this one, please leave a comment in the comment section. I'm sure you're going to enjoy this one. So I'm going to just pour out a glass just to show you what it looks like. You can see it's got a nice thickness to it. That's what it looks like in a glass. Oh, and it's, it's really nice. But, so sometimes when you see something what you have used for different things, you try a different recipe. And I want to thank my subscriber who donated the tamarind if you if you want to now to juice the tamarind you just shell them there's a little string bit on the on the side of the vein you just take that off then 
just soak them in some hot water overnight then just get a fork or something can stir them around or you can crush them out with your hand so that's your tamarind and that's the tamarind punch for you i hope you enjoy this one please remember to like share and subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend and hopefully we'll see you all on the next one thank you